Good morning guys, David Garibian here, a real estate investor based in St. Paul, Minnesota. I'm mostly buying multi-family apartment buildings as a buy and hold. In today's video, I'm going to talk about how to make a deal. So every day I send a bunch of letters to the owner operators here in Minnesota market. I do cold call and I get responses about making an offer, uh, send me a you know purchase agreement, or a lot of times people just uh, the owners tell, hey, make me an offer. I don't even know my finances are a mess. I just don't even know how much the building is worth. So in today's video, I'm gonna cover a typical scenario. This is an actual deal uh, for a purpose of this video. I'm not going to disclose the address location of the property because I am working on this deal but uh, these deals are plentiful in every market no matter where you are uh, there are so many of these kind of properties that it's just unbelievable nobody's tapping into this market so this uh, property is 34 unit property let me just get my cheat sheet here so it's a 34 unit property, uh, 24 units are two bedroom apartments and 10 units are one bedroom apartments. The rents are 900 bucks for two bedroom, actually $1,000 for two bedroom and $900 for one bedroom apartments. Now the owner said, it's a complete mess. My finances are disaster. Uh, the guy has over, 15 properties, he's managing the deals himself, he's just exhausted handling tenants. He mentioned also that his property manager passed away, now all the hassle and all the burden is on him. So, and uh, the thing is, he, he here is the deal guys, you don't have to have the, all the financial finances to make sense of the deal. Uh, hang, around, hang out in this video and I'll show you how to make sense of the deal, how to make an offer. I'm going to jot down some numbers on my whiteboard, so hang around. Okay, so let me write down the numbers for your record. So 24 units at $1,000 and 10 units at $900. Uh, these are two bedroom and these are one bedroom so so this is an information you have so how much should you offer that's the question all right so numbers one more time so gross rents on this property six nine four hundred ninety six thousand a year let me make sure guys always run the numbers uh, a couple of times so you're not making a mistake so 396 I was up by hundred thousand so anyway so as a rule of thumb expenses usually run at 40% of the property so that 40% of that will be 150,400 and your NOI on this deal will be 200 37,600 bucks. So this is your NOI. So this building is a little older, old, older building. It's the area is not a, you know, not totally bad, but you know, it's so, so some sketchy people there. I drove by the property uh, last week. So I'm going to offer this owner 8% cap rate. So I want my money, what I invest 
to earn 8%. So basically what we do is we divide this 237,000 by 8% and we come up with 2,970,000 bucks. So can you see this? So this is how much you should offer for this building. Now, again, the buyer only told me this information. He only told me the unit mix and how much they rent for. Now you can make this offer, but as uh, you know, you agree to terms, then you want to go to due diligence process and then uh, you verify the information, make sure that the property can actually sustain this offer or you go to the check out the expenses, what rehab needs, deferred maintenance, and you can adjust the price. But this is quick and easy way to offer on a property when the property owner says, hey, my finances are a mess. I don't even know how much to, uh, how much I'm gonna ask for the my building, make me an offer. Well, as you know, the rents, you can come up with the offer. And uh, next week's video, I'm going to talk about how to work this deal actually. So in three, four years, you can buy this property with very little down payment. That's a tricky trick I'm going to talk about in next week's video. I hope this video finds you well. If you enjoyed the content, hit the like button. If you absolutely hated it, hit the thumbs up button. Comment, subscribe to my channel. Let me know you're there. Let me know you're watching. Don't be a mystery. A lot of times, friends, uh, acquaintances watch the video but then they don't say anything so I don't even know who watched it or who didn't watch it how am I doing on the video please 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 give me a feedback I really really appreciate it again thanks for watching have a blessed uh, Tuesday and go do some deals take care